Hello, I'm Steph, and today I'm going to be taking you through my first Zara haul, starting with this beautiful palette from Carly Bible and Anastasia. It has these beautiful, cool, and warm tones that I like to mix, and this brownish red lipstick from MAC called Marrakesh. Here I'm choosing some rings by Mango, which are currently some of my faves. As well as this necklace that has like this gorgeous dangling pearl and a gold pendant at the end. It's like three layers. And these little baddie eyelashes from Tarte. Here we are on to outfit number one. Okay, so let's talk about this dress here. Uh, I really like the light and flowiness of it. It has like these very vibrant bohemian colors like berries and gold and violets and it looks very exotic. Uh, here you can see all the little uh, buttons that run down across in very intricate patterns. I paired it with these black suede knee-high boots to add an extra layer of warmth as well as these black leather gloves because the fabric is so thin and delicate and this is for like transitional winter weather here you can see how thin but it has these beautiful gold uh, threads that go all across the black pinstripes and the purple paisley pattern with the orange hues kind of made it match with my eyeshadow You can see how I cinched in the waist to kind of give it more of a shape. It looks really fun with those gloves. Here you could see me uh, pairing it with this rich maroon coat with black faux fur all over the collar. And I really like how these maroons complement the blacks. And so for the final touch, I added this really long, rich red plaid scarf by Ralph Lauren with this beautiful gold embroidery at the bottom corner. It's such an intense outfit with rich reds all over. Okay, so here we are with outfit number two. You know, it wasn't one of my favorites. I really went out of my comfort zone to try on this burgundy animal print, which I wouldn't normally go for, but I had a lot of fun uh, because of the ruffles and the unique cut on the bottom part as, as well as the sleeves. I really love the mock neck. And once I put on the gloves, and uh, I layered it with the belt and the coat. Of course, I began to like it a lot more. I actually think my favorite part was once I added the cream ecru plaid scarf, also from Ralph Lauren. But here you can see uh, the Via Spago coat. It's like a camel with a dark hair, faux fur color. Very cozy indeed, and a leather strap. Here's the scarf. And what a difference it makes once you can see the contrast tie it all together.
Okay ladies, now this dress was absolutely my favorite one out of the entire haul. I mean look at these sleeves. They have these gold threads and this intricate like baby blue snake pattern. My goodness, it is so delicate and ruffled and feminine. I absolutely love this subtle blue and, and with this beautiful taupe coat and boots. They complement each other so, so very well. Yeah, this dress would have easily looked really beautiful with gold uh, strappy heels, but I really enjoy the for of, of chillier weather. You know, you can pair it with this fur coat, which I believe it's a fox fur. And um, the knee-high toe boots, I believe are Steve Madden's. So this dress for sure I will be keeping. Absolutely in love with it. So for the final dress, here we are at outfit number four, which is this beautiful, creamy, beigey dress with antiquated roses and olive greens. Uh, here are these beautiful suede buttons and balloon sleeves. Also very thin and delicate. This dress has a very like baroque and rococo feel to it. Very much romantic. The fit was just a little too short. Here I'm styling it with the same taupe foxy coat. A very 1920s vintage coat I was given. And these taupe boots, which are very much fun. So at the end of this haul, I ended up just keeping one of the four dresses. If you would like to guess which one that was, it's definitely the baby blue uh, snake print. But let me know your thoughts and which dress you liked best in the comments. And I will be seeing you on the next one.